which iron cannot catalyse the reaction between iodide and peroxidized sulfate? Use the data to help you answer your question. So the, the peroxidized sulfate is here. The iodide ion is here. So they react together, although the reaction is going to be slow because two negative ions are going to repel. That's going to have a very high activation energy. But we need something that could help us with the um, reduction of the peroxidisulfate but, and the oxidation of iodide. So let's just go down the table. So if we were to pick cobalt 2 plus, would that work? So if we were to use cobalt 2 plus, and we're trying to find one that wouldn't work, but we're going to try and see whether they would work. So cobalt 2 plus could react with S2O82 minus. It would because it's got a, a less positive electrode potential than the S2O82 minus, and so the cobalt 2 plus would get um, oxidized while the peroxidisulfate gets reduced, turning it to cobalt 3 plus, which would then is above the iodide, so would then be able to react with the iodide. So that one would work. Chromium 2 plus is here. So chromium 2 plus could react with the peroxidisulfate ions because the value is it's lower in the table but then chromium 3 plus would not be able to react with the iodide ions because it's too low its value so this one would not work so the answer is going to be chromium 2 plus but let's just double check the others is fe2 plus in between what we're really looking for is anything that would catalyze this these two processes would be from in between them and they can go in either order reactions so any of these four cobalt 2 plus cobalt 3 plus iron 3 plus iron 2 plus would act as a catalyst for these two this overall reaction so the only things we couldn't use are chromium 3 plus or chromium 2 plus so we're going to select answer b